Did you know that World's Edge might be changing in the next Apex Legends mobile update? What's going on Legends? My name's Rose and in today's video we're going to be looking at the new potential map changes coming to Apex Mobile. And also a few days ago I made a post asking for your guys feedback on what kind of changes you want to see in the game. But first guys, the map changes. Now you already saw in my last video about the Loba event, Diamonds in the Snow, which brought us some in-game hints like this Loba event tag on the walls and Loba's ultimate ability inside the vault rooms in the map. Now take note of the word snow in Diamonds in the Snow. If you take a look at the climatizer section of the map, the big tower with a, basically a big beam coming out of the top of it, it's now glowing orange. It started glowing orange when this event started. Now stuff like this happens before on the PC and console version and it basically indicates that a big sort of change is coming to the map. Now the Loba event that's going on right now ends on the 15th of June in seven days time so we'll most likely get an update then and by update I mean a big update. Now in my last video I said that season 2 could come on the 15th but that's most likely incorrect as the Apex Mobile seasons have been mentioned before by Respawn to last two months long and the game only did come out three weeks ago so I don't think we're going to get season 2 next week. Now back to the tower. This beaming orange light can mean that the whole map will be changed into a snowy world's edge or maybe it's just some certain parts that change the snow like the surroundings of this tower. Regardless I think it's a cool idea to bring map changes as you know we probably won't see King's Canyon the first map for a long time. Now these changes are cool and fun but obviously you guys want the real changes like optimization and more servers and we need them to happen quickly right? Now the first comment I got from you guys is from a guy called Zest who says I think we can all agree ping, store prices and game bugs like hearing the fake gunshots are the most problematic. Now I agree with all of this guys okay the ping is a big issue in Apex Legends Mobile as the servers are split which results on higher ping for most players every other game you play. Now store prices are also very very bad right now with some skins cost over a hundred dollars which is a crazy amount for a global launch of a game and then obviously in-game bugs yes there's a lot of in-game bugs like gun shooting in a distance when there's nobody actually there basically the gun sound glitch uh real fights that are actually happening somewhere in the map but they're happening really far away but it sounds like they're happening close to you so it's a stupid glitch next comment i got is from a guy called exist who has listed most of the problems and among them is b hop so i've covered this before guys bunny hopping does need to get removed or nerfed super hard. The fact that you can glide across the map, which makes it feel like you're in spectator mode, is crazy and it's nothing like the PC and console version. A lot of people are saying, yeah, it's a big skill gap and it should be kept in the game, but no, it's not how Apex Legends is played. Now, this post actually got over 200 comments full of feedback, which I'm going to compile for you guys and send over to Respawn for you. I've already mentioned in my last video that I've been speaking to them and me and a couple of other CCs are going to be speaking to them soon and really all this feedback to them and hopefully combating all of the issues in the game. Now the 15th of June next week is when this Diamonds in the Snow event ends so we're probably going to get a big update then which could fix a lot of these issues but don't hope too much because these sort of issues aren't going to be fixed in one simple update. Now I've listed the priorities here of what exactly we need first to happen so starting with number one we need better optimization so more players can enjoy the game. Number two add more servers and split them up to give players lower ping when playing and make it more enjoyable. Number three, fix in-game bugs like sound glitches and getting stuck in doors. Number four, fix the unlimited bunny hop feature to make it feel like Apex Legends again. Number five, more social communication with players to make it feel like you're actually taking enough feedback from the community. And then number six, the monetization prices in the store. There's honestly a lot to do, guys. I'm kind of glad that we're getting at least some sort of mini updates in the game to make it a bit more enjoyable. That's one thing Apex are really good at is bringing us cool, fun events and sort of in-game stuff. But anyway, guys, I'm doing all I can my end. So hopefully we get to see some changes soon and hopefully we get an update next week on the 15th. Make sure you guys hit a sub and like and enjoy the gameplay. Um, you can have our approval. <gasps> Words of affirmation. Words of affirmation. Yes. You are a very good boy. Damn, now it's your turn. <laughs> Excuse me, why? I think you said. I don't know how I would feel, but I wouldn't feel I wouldn't feel good about it. I'm so out of here. Well, I can't refer to this one um, and that hurt my feelings. Hey. Hi, this game's too easy. <laughs> what 
was you. Did you just did you just murder them all? No. Oh. So what do you guys? So uh, I mean, sorry, girls like to do for fun. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, I like to play board oh, games. The house. Oh, nice. What kind of board because games? That's more like... You guys like Stranger Things? Oh, um, yes. actually, I. I... I have not watched the new season. Yeah, me too. Oh my I god, like, they all die. Like, all the kids die. It's crazy. Oh, That's so oh cool. yeah. It's crazy. That's the plot twist of the century. It is. No, 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 no. Oh, wait, this isn't that way. No, no, this is this way. That's, that's need her help? secret name. Why do I keep getting into fights when I'm, I'm not cheating on Going doing the yellow stuff. Guys, I have no ammo. <laughs> that is impossible. So, guys, I can't help you. I'm looking for ammo. Can I steal some of that ammo? I am on Go eight ahead. zero ammo. A good old zero. Is a care package. Care package? Uh, it's a package with <laughs> some stuff in it. Wow. No, that's serious, that's what it is. <laughs> like, sometimes you can't tell when you're being sarcastic, so I was like, just need a carry. <laughs> <laughs> I did like nothing. Nice right. for carrying me. I know, you guys actually killed it. Good win. Oh yeah, oh yeah for sure. Well um twenty nine freaking kills. Yeah. That's why I wasn't getting any kills. That's you so stole them all. Oh. <laughs> I'm not using the hacks, don't worry. But yeah. <laughs> no, I think oh. Yeah, it seemed like you were just genuinely good. In my defense, I've only been playing this for two days, so <laughs> Damn. Well, uh, aggressive kills for two days. well, feel free to add me. Bye -bye. Feel free to sub on uh, YouTube, watch me on Trovo, and I'll catch you in the next stream. Bye-bye. Okay. Cool. Bye. Bye. Bye.